You know, now to a shooting investigation after a party in Lauder Hill took a dangerous and violent turn. Police say at least three people were shot. NBC6 reporter Marissa Bag spoke to a woman who was at that party joining us live now from Lauder Hill. Tell us more on this, Marissa. Sure thing, Shelly. Yeah, this event going on last night when those shots were fired, and it was a fairly large event. There were people here to see their favorite Jamaican artist perform. You can see the stage that's set up over there, and it was actually just before that lead act could, took the stage here that partygoers tell me they heard four gunshots and then ran for their lives. One woman sharing video of this chaotic aftermath as people were running. This location is just off of State Road 7 North of Sunrise Boulevard. Now, Lauder Hill police say it was right around 1223 this morning. Three people were shot, two men shot in the head and a woman shot in the shoulder. Officers say that all three of them are now stable, receiving treatment at Florida Medical Center. Now, other people tell us they were bruised when they fell or got stepped on as they were trying to get away. One woman says that one of the victims actually came up to her to ask whether he'd been shot in the head. Just ran like everybody else did and it just so happened that me and my sister were standing by the gate and he was like I got shot and we were like no you didn't he said yes I did in my head and then we'd seen the blood and we was like oh yeah you got shot in your head and it was like come with us come with us because I had just called the police and I was trying to direct them here and back out here live, you can see the mess that's left behind out here after people just ran. They tell me that they paid upwards of 30 to $80 to get into this show. And people really wondering, questioning how somebody got in here with a gun. They say there was security here at all of the entrances and the exits. They were also thankful that there were multiple exits because people were able to get out at different areas of this location. Now, according to Lauder Hill Police, they say that they have no suspects. If if you have any information, you can share that with Broward County Crime Stoppers. We are live here in Lauderhill, Marissa Bag, NBC6 News.